Now, police just released surveillance video showing a group of thieves breaking into a car near 145th and Metcalf in Overland Park. Police there believe they're part of a string of break-ins from over the weekend. As Lindsay Shively explains, there could be a simple fix to stop these thefts. Oh man, Mark, it seems like a no-brainer. Lock your car, right? But Overland Park police say people are doing it. Almost 300 unlocked cars were burglarized last year. That's about half of the total car burglaries they dealt with. So Overland Park police have really been ramping up their use of these. See these flyers? Are you the next victim? They've been going around parking lots and hot spots, looking in cars, seeing if they are unlocked, and seeing if there's any valuables in plain sight. And they've been marking if there are or if those uh, car owners did a good job and nothing was visible. Then they take this flyer and they put it underneath the windshield wipers to wake people up that they have to protect themselves. Surveillance video shows how easily these suspects got into this car. Police call unlocked cars a big problem. 40 reported car thefts just in the last few weeks came from unlocked cars. Well, I think once you have a break in, you start getting a little bit smarter. Beth Jelinek got a GPS stolen out of her car this weekend, even though it was locked. Oh, it's, locked. it's locked. Amazing. And she was pleasantly surprised. Her son's van in the driveway was locked too. Oh, so was Katie Pettis. She was sure her two brothers' cars would be unlocked. And me too. I'm guilty of doing that too. Like, I'm on my lunch break right now. I'm coming home real quick. I know I've left it unlocked before, so. We tested our own parking lot. Uh oh, found one. Three out of 16 cars were unlocked. If you don't think this is a big issue, we've got over 40 reports that prove contrary. Overland Park police beg to differ. Yeah. Yeah, take a look at this, this list. We cannot underscore the importance of the valuables being in plain sight. Another huge part of this equation, and you heard them, they took 40 police reports of unlocked cars that were burglarized just in the last few weeks south of 119th Street, something we've really got to start paying attention to. We're live, Lindsay Shively, 41 Action News.